Hello again, everyone. It is your Black Knight. That's right. Here it's Christmas time, and I've picked up almost oh, a second and a half after the last video. You're really talking continuity going on here. One of the things that I want to do with this money that I've just made is take advantage of not arena war. Now, I know what you're thinking. I've already unlocked by pure luck the trade. The trade price, yeah, the trade price. I can talk on the Apocalypse Imperator and the Future Shock Imperator. And I can afford both of those with millions to spare. I have enough to upgrade them, but they're gonna be there. They're gonna be there, and I have some other things that I want to accomplish. For instance, did you know that right now do, 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 the Omnis is on sale? And there's snow on the ground? I mean, come on. This is just, you know, should we go retro rally? Or classic rally? Classic rally is, you know, that's what you see every time Ruffy gets online here. I think we're going to go retro rally because we want to be, we want to be different. We'll go, is it a different price? Okay, the one price disappears. It's still, stri it's still striked out. I'm not paying 700, no, we'll get classic rally. We'll go We'll do that just because I want to make sure that's up there. I'm sure we can change it if we want. We're gonna put that in the paro. All right, that's just 400k, right? No big deal. What's the you know, deal on that? All right, we're not done yet. This next part takes a little bit of a little bit of talking and a little bit of discussion. Swap character. Now, I know what you're all saying. Swap character. Hey, you know, something just occurred to me. Your other character, the not-CEO in pajamas character, not the regular Black Knight character, is named Rusty Jack, and he's got an outlaw racing history. In theory. Why isn't Rusty Jack your Arena Wars character? Wouldn't that make more sense to put him in the Arena Wars? He's all the rusty cars, I mean, it would be perfect for him. And that's his opinion on, on, on the Arena Wars, ladies and gentlemen. Let me explain to you. See, Rusty Jack got his his reputation driving old beater cars and beating much more expensive cars, trying to make ends meet as an outlaw racer in a time of ec economic recession. And, you know, it's not that, you know, he just loves rusty cars. He can appreciate the beauty in all vehicles, and he can make do with what he has to make do with. That doesn't mean that he wouldn't rather drive a Wagner. He can see the beauty in that, too. He's not going to pick rust over, you know, over gold. It's just a matter of that's what he's been... Oh, near. Mr. hey, Mr. Hacker. Here we go. It's not that, you know, he, he can't appreciate good cars. It's not that he'll choose rust over good cars. It's just that that was what he had to work with, and that's how he earned his reputation. Now... See, I'm here in Supply Street, and that's for a reason. One of the other things that's going on is this 30% off all Benny's upgrades, and I have been sitting on a couple of these cars. Not the second orange one. That's one's going to stay as it is. We're going to keep one salt in. It's pristine. But this salt, and I forget how I got it. it was something cool went on with it. Where it saved me from some bad, bad thing. And I decided it was going to stay in my inventory. And it's getting upgraded. If we survive. So I've been meaning to upgrade these the next time that there's a Benny sale. I need about 800k for that. Which would still leave me in pretty good stead for building myself back up and getting the, the Mad Max mobile somewhere down the line. And considering my experience thus far has been I do have a custom, you know, death bike, and that's more than enough for what you need to do. I, I don't need the... Oh, here we go. So I guess we're not going to be bored this session, are we? I just really... Really must wait... Really? Oh, 
I'm hoping I have insurance on this thing. I think I do. Let's see if we can get into Benny's. We'll check the insurance to stay us right there. Come on. Alright. I think we'll be safe now. What you need? So he's cost me a few hundred here in repairs and Benny's is expensive, so $175 in repair. There you go. Upgrade. There we have it. That's a good deal. 30% off. And no, I'm not doing a darn thing else with it. This is just for taking advantage. Oh, we want to do that. Make sure it's insured. Yeah, we got full coverage. We're always safe. We're just taking advantage of that sale. It's, uh, it's on the Benny's upgrades. Now I'm wondering, that having been said, are the individual upgrades on sale? Tell Let's me what see. you want. Like, if I put a turbo on this, is it less than 50,000? Armor. It doesn't show it as being on sale. Uh, they're not they're not listed as discounted. I don't know that they are. And even so, not that big a deal. I don't actually know what I want to do with this yet. It's all right. We'll wait. We'll wait on this. You know, there's paying customers outside. I just gave you half a million dollars. Don't give me an attitude. Don't give me an attitude. Okay, we're gonna take this back to Supply Street. It's still a work in progress, obviously. That's one more supercar in his uh, his livery, so you got that. Yeah, I can't remember what the story was on this new gray uh, Subaru. I think we'll leave it gray, but it was, there was something significant. I go through. Maybe there's a video. <laughs> Might be a video I haven't even voiced over yet. I have hours and hours and hours of things to voice over. That's why it's such a treat when I can do it live, you know, because... Excuse me. So Sultan's extra special because the only way you can get them. Well, now you can get it now. You can, used to be the only way you could get it was by thievery, but you can buy them now. Same with this one here, I think. Let's go. The Buccaneer Lowrider is something I don't have a single one of in this game. Don't say anything. I don't know you. Or maybe I do. I, I don't remember. <laughs> I got a job. A job that's so hot, we're gonna bury it in an ex-government facility under about a hundred feet of desert. <laughs> you think you're up for it? Buy the facility on May's Bank and I'll meet you over there. This is bigger than any bank job we could ever pull. That's another reason that I'm not doing arena war stuff with this guy, because this character is designed to be my, my low overhead character. Like, yeah, he's got to have garages. Yeah, he's got to have an office because, you know, the CEO stuff is too important. Yeah, he has a biker business because a place to store bikes. And I'll probably get an arena or a garage at some point when he runs out of parking spaces. But here's the deal. Arena War is, is not profitable enough to make it worthwhile. I mean, it's just not. If you want the cars, you do arena wars, and you can make if you like it, you can enjoy yourself, and that's all fun. But you're not making enough money to cover what you're investing in your arena wars from arena wars. So when I'm doing arena wars, me. what am I doing? When I'm doing arena wars with the CEO in pajamas, I've got my I've got my nightclub generating, uh, you know, stuff from all of my businesses. It's it's creating cargo for me to sell. So while I'm doing arena wars, there's another profit angle that's going on. There. 273,000. See, that is a good deal. Do it. You ain't gonna regret that. Really not. Can we put a roof on this? It's snowing out. No roof. Stock roof. You want the stock roof? But this kind of looked good. Custom roof. Custom roof too. 
eh, let's leave it. Let's leave it clear for the time being. We're not even gonna spend that much money. Let's make sure we have insurance. We do. I wonder if this has a top that comes up. Can we put the top up? Nope, it's strictly a speedster. All right, well, still, for the for the little bit we have to drive, we can we can be here in a t-shirt, a little breezy. This dude's cool, right? He's a cool dude. So at least while I'm doing, you know, motor wars when it's double RP, I'm making more money because every every minute that goes by, I'm getting potentially more stuff in my. My uh, nightclub, you know, that, that's how you get the big money in this. You send, you install all your stuff out of your nightclub. There's a million bucks. Cages, oh great. Look, I just want, I don't even really need to get this car back because we're done as far as purchases are concerned now. Sleepy Keith. Oh, it's none of that. Guys, what? The gingerbread man, I guess. Okay, that's... Got some Christmas cheer going on here. Still. Let's get this puppy home. We're not going to invest in it right now. I am going to go and look through the rest of my garage to see if there's anything else we want to benefit. Just at least using the mechanic, you know? Won't be a full garage tour here, folks, but, you know, we'll... Let's see if there's anything else we want to do with this character before I switch back. I'll probably have a mile for a while because we need to build our stuff up. We're only a hundred grand away from getting an Imperator. Karater. Karuder. Why do they call it the Imperator? Why not just another... It's a Falcon, so why not call it, like, you know, the Hawk or something? You need something, huh? One of your rides? Let me know. Okay, the Dune Loader, can't do anything with the Dune Loader. Sand King, Injection, no. Sand King, Sand King. The Voodoo you could, but that Voodoo I want to keep as a Rusty Voodoo. That's like a, that's a key thing. The Rusty Voodoo next to the Paradise. This is, this was how I had him set up. This was his spawn location back when making uh, money was, the best way to make money was selling Sand Kings. Greenwich Parkway is empty. What? Interesting. Get the, okay, this is where we are. The Vigero, the Sultan R.S., the Sultan, and the, the Buccaneer Topless. Bad, okay, these are all bikes. We're not doing anything with bikes. I don't think I have anything here that's... You, you can upgrade the bike. You know, there's, there, is a, there was one bike that you could do that with. That. I, I own it. The Manana. You can do the Manana. Can't you, can't you do a Manana Custom? think about that. Maybe we'll pull the banana out. Ruiner. We have another banana. We have two bananas? One of those is... Wait a minute. No, that, that second one is that custom one. It's a green one. Serrano, Oracle, Picador. Is there a Picador custom? I don't even know my cars anymore. The Mesa, no. More than that, right? Duke of Death, Habanero, Cabrio. You could do a tornado, uh, lowrider. But that might be, that, uh, that tornado might not, yeah, that's a rusty tornado if it's anything. Okay, we'll keep that rusty. I don't want to go completely whole hog here and make myself broke. I'll get back to work. Maybe the man. Let's see how big the how expensive the man is. 
with the room. What you need, boss? Some wheels? I can bring them around. Should have done this one, I think. Let's see. Let's I'll get there the as right soon one. as I can. Let's see if it's the I'll right get back banana. to it then. Oh, check this out. Somebody has a whoa! Somebody's left their car out on the road. This just being spawned in? It's of course the custom uh, Arena War Dominator here with the uh, the tombstone on the back. Yeah, this is a plain banana. I remember this one. This banana. I might keep this one as it is. This, this banana was the one where I, I got from a, one of the NPCs had it completely wedged, hooked through something or other. See what we can do with this. So take it to Benny's. I don't even know if the banana is one that you can you can trick out, but it should be. I mean, if any car deserves it, I would love that. This is our last experiment. I'm going to leave my tornadoes alone. I don't recall the lowrider tornado is really cool. Even on sale. And I really need to save some of that. So I'm imagining that a lowrider banana 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 that will be a big deal. Trigger a job. I want to go into Benny's. Do I have to be out of the blue dot to trigger this? Come on. It's a banana. It's big. Oh, it's not a Benny's vehicle. I thought he would. I thought he would do any vehicle, but you couldn't do the upgrades. Oh, folks, that's just you know, that's just ducky. Quite a digital footprint you're making, you don't mind my saying so. A little foolish. Anyway, there's only one thing an operator like you needs right now, and that's doomsday protection. No. Really, there's a lot more to the underground bunker we just put up on May's bank for closures, including business opportunities. No. But that's part of it. Log on, take a look, and buy it. You won't regret it. My bunker is pretty much useless to me without the, the fact that... Oh, here we go. I'm so sad you don't take my offers of help seriously. It's so rude of you. So many phone calls. Now, this is, like I said, my low overhead character. I am not going to have a bunker on this one. Uh, Sleepy Keith is glitching. He'd be glitching. I'm just checking the insurance on this. Apparently I'm fixing the hood. Here for the magic touch? $230 just to make sure that it's insured. And it is. I got one with our trees. I got one all that. I kind of like a clean banana banana banana. This might be a good place to end it. I mean, that is... That's a beautiful shot right there. On that note, ladies and gentlemen, we've, we've done some Christmas shopping here for both the Black Knight and for, for Rusty Jack. Not to take out the... Uh, Take out that new present that the uh, the Black Knight has here. The ominous. See how it slides around the snow at some point. But that is a video for another day. And on this note, this is your Black Knight. Have a great night.